On top of that breaking news this morning out of East Grand Rapids, crews still battling a house fire there. 24 Hour News 8's Marvis Herring has been there since 4.30 this morning. He just spoke with fire crews. What are they telling you right now? Well, Lindsay and Casey, good morning. I've been speaking with the incident commander just here in the last 20 minutes, and he says, despite the freezing cold this morning, the biggest problem right now is putting out hot spots. You can see a number of lights back behind there. I don't know if you can see that this morning, but there's firefighters still looking inside of the house for more hot spots that they say have been flaring up here just in the last few minutes, more than five hours after this house fire sparked out. We have video when we first got here at the scene. There were Flames still coming from the rooftop. I'm told that the fire is believed to have started somewhere near the attic and then just kind of taken off there and set the whole roof on fire. We're here along Wealthy near Plymouth. It's right across the street from Spectrum Health Blodgett Hospital. And I'm told just here in the last few minutes that the damage inside is extensive. When you think about the smoke, the water, the flames, it's the perfect recipe for just total damage. It may be a complete loss here at this home. And one big issue this morning, we do know that there were no injuries. There were no, there's no one inside, but one big issue has been contacting the homeowners. They may be still um, in, in the dark about what exactly happened, and crews are still looking into what exactly caused it. Right now, they're not sure if it's suspicious or not. Live in East Grand Rapids, Marvis Herring, 24-Hour News 8.